I hope everyone is doing well and uh, having a great start to their Tuesday. Over the last couple of weeks, uh, while I've been doing the Devo, I have pulled something from one of our God times for our kiddos. Um, these are devotion cards that go along with what our kids are learning on Sunday mornings. And so there's four of them, and so kids at home can um, complete one of these every day of the week. And it's just um, some scripture and maybe a little activity or a thought that goes along with the lesson for the week. And um, this month we're actually talking about responsibility. And so all of these um, different God time cards go around that idea of responsibility. And so... Um, we're going to learn to be responsible, too, along with our elementary schoolers. So today I want to read from Galatians 6, verse 10, and it says, So then, as we have opportunity, let us do good to everyone, and especially to those who are of the household of faith. Just do it. You've probably heard that phrase before. This three-word slogan was introduced in Nike's ads in 1987 as a way of um, marketing their brand and inspiring athletes of every level to push themselves to keep going and to do the work. So this is um, included in our, in our God Time card for this week. Um, Just Do It and Nike is something that kids can relate to, um, and I'm sure that you guys can relate to them as well. Um, you might be wearing a pair of Nike shoes right now. So just do it. We read Galatians 6.10 and we think just do it. So Galatians 6.10 again says, So then as we have opportunity, let us do good to everyone and especially to those who are of the household of faith. So you're probably wondering what does just do it have to do with that? These words just do it aren't new. Um, Paul wrote them in um, the book of Galatians. And thousands of years ago to churches in Galatia saying when we can do good to everyone just do it so when you have the opportunity to be good to others just do it don't um, dwell on the things that could be holding you up don't think of all the reasons why you shouldn't help someone just do it when you have the opportunity to help or to share or love others show them God's love don't just sit there just do it. And so this week, I want to challenge you guys to do something. This is what um, this God Time card challenges our kiddos to do. I want you to take an index card or a post-it note or something and write the words, just do it. And then I want you to take that index card or um, that post-it note, and I want you to tape it to your door frame. Maybe it's your bedroom door, uh, the door to the garage, your front door, whatever it is, a door that you, a door frame that you go through a lot, I want you to tape it on the door frame. And as you leave that room each morning, I want you to read those three words out loud. So I want you to actually say, just do it out loud and ask God to help you share what you have with others. And then after you ask God um, that day to help you share what you have with others, and you've read those just do it words, I just want you to tap that card or that post-it note and acknowledge that you are willing to do good to everyone as you head out the door. And start your day off just knowing that you are going to just do it and you are going to share what you have with others. That could be something as silly as um, sharing a pen with a coworker or something um, that's an object you could be sharing but also, I want us to think more, and I want us to think of sharing God's love with others, because you have God's love. That's something that you have, and I want you to share it with others this week. I want you to just do it. And so, um, maybe it seems silly. Uh, maybe some of these ideas feel like they're meant for kids, um, but sometimes I think it's important for us to just have childlike um tendencies and to allow ourselves to learn like kids do. And so um, make that index card and tape it on your door frame this week and um, go out and share God's love. It's a responsibility that we all have to share God's love with others. And there's only way we can do it, and that's by just doing it. So that's what I have this morning. That's my encouragement from um, Galatians 6.10. 
and I'll go ahead and pray for us, and I'll let you guys get on with your Tuesdays. God, thank you so much um, for your goodness and your love, God. Um, we have a huge responsibility to go out and to share that love with others, and God, I pray that um, even though it's easy to come up with excuses and reasons why we shouldn't go out and share with others, God, I pray that this week that we learn to just do it and we go out and we um, share your love with others and we don't make up excuses to do so. God, thank you for your goodness and um, your mercy and all the gifts that you've given us. God, we love you and we praise you. It's in your name we pray. Amen. All right, go out and be blessed this week and learn to share with others.